Hey guys, I'm Bronson, and in this video I have this cool conspiracy theory that I have. So, I've made two other videos, and there was a little piece of information that I got in both videos, and then I had kind of a, a an epiphany, and I kind of put two both together, and I was like, oh, maybe, maybe this. So, I'll go over that now. So, I made one video that talked about the print run of... Welcome to Wrath and Arcane Rising and Crucible War. And I was trying to look at the boxes. So if you look up here, uh, the one right above me is Welcome to Wrath. The one at the very end is, I think, Arcane Rising. And then this one right here is, uh, this, <laughs> this one right here is Crucible War. You can obviously read that right there. So I made this. And the thing I noticed is that the numbers are different. So if you'll notice that, uh, Welcome to Wrath has T9, and then Crucible of War has T0, but then uh, Arcane Rising has this weird, funky, like, uh, four-digit thing where it says T920, and I was like, huh, and the, and, and the rest of the numbers on that one are just, just kind of weird. It, 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 it didn't follow the, the same order as the other one, so there you go, okay. Then I made another video talking about the card quality of each set, and I noticed, huh, these Arcane Rising ones, they, they have the slight curl. Yeah, that's kind of interesting, huh? And then I was thinking about it one day, and I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> like, the, the card quality is different from Arcane Rising than the other two. So my conspiracy theory is this, guys. I think that Arcane Rising was produced in another facility other than the other two sets. Now... What we've been told from Legend Story Studios, and I do 100% believe this, that Cardamundi, Cardamunde, uh, whatever the pronunciation is, please correct me below, uh, they are their supplier for printing these cards. I totally am not debating that. I just think that there's a different facility that produced these cards for Legend Story Studios with the Arcane Rising set versus the other two. Does this matter at all? No. <laughs> like, this doesn't really matter at all. But this, this, this highlights something really important to you guys. Is that when I'm analyzing things, I, I, I take in everything, man. I look at all the pieces of the puzzle. And sometimes, if you are really paying attention, and, and I'm really, like, in the zone, and I, I can think about these things... I kind of put these things, these pieces together, and it's kind of cool. It's kind of, it's, it's discovery. Nobody, this information isn't out there. Nobody's saying, hey, we used the different, you know, printers for this set versus the other. Does it matter in this case? No. In the future, could it matter? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe it'll matter in the future. But uh, for na right now, this, this piece of information, this conspiracy theory. Even if even if it's correct, even if there's a different printer, it really doesn't matter. It's it's a different machine in the same country, <laughs> producing the same cards, and and there's a slight there's a very very slight curl on the cards for Arcane Rising. I it really doesn't matter though. At the end of the day, the card quality is great, guys. I'm not I'm not dissing it. I'm not dissing anything. Uh, the 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 card quality is exceptional. Uh. It's just, it's a really kind of, I thought it was interesting. I, I hope you thought it was interesting too, and this wasn't a waste of your time. But I thought it was cool how I took two pieces of information that I knew, and I jammed them together to make this conspiracy theory. I'll have to reach out to LSS, see if they can comment on this. I, I don't know if they can or not, but it really doesn't matter at the end of the day. At the end of the day, the cards were made, the cards are beautiful, and I love the products. It's, it's no big deal what machine they were printed on but it's really cool to i don't know just think outside the box thanks for watching